What is up YouTube? Welcome back to another weekly recap for the Natural Bodybuilding Prep Series. Um, today just going to be covering eight weeks out, recapping it, and then talking about seven weeks and kind of plans going forward for the prep. Um, I won't lie to you, just traveling back to Texas and driving back from Wisconsin, a little bit behind on recording this already Wednesday of the following week. So you guys are a bit behind, so hopefully keep this one short and sweet and to the point. Um, and if you guys are just tuning in for the first time, I will link the playlist for the prep series or so check it out on the channel. But just another week has went by, so we're going to cover everything, and this will be an interesting one on the nutrition side of things and kind of going to skip over training for today's video. Um, be the first week of a new block, but no exercise selection or anything has really changed. Um, so nothing groundbreaking to cover there. So actually going to throw up the nutrition now just to make sure I can get this video out in a timely fashion to you guys who probably see it on Thursday. Um, but yeah, as I had mentioned, for nutrition with being home for the week of the fourth, I kind of knew nutrition would be a bit looser in terms of like calorie intake and whatnot um, and kind of expected weight to jump up a bit just with eating a bit more and that also not being perfect with tracking. So probably ate more calories than what was actually tracked in most cases over less. Um, but for the week came out at 241 grams of protein, 338 carb, 90 fat and then calories roughly 3109 so a couple hundred up from what we would normally do um did stick to the cardio and training regimen did have a deload last week so just two sets of everything for the most part at like 70 to 90 percent of the weight depending on the exercise um, and then for cardio as always doing 20 minutes inclined treadmill um, and that'll be at a 12 and a half incline and three miles per hour. It'll get you right out to that 200 calories. Some days I'll crank up the speed a bit more, but still get into that mile length and 200 calories. So keeping everything in check there. And then for um, the weigh-ins, you can kind of see how my weight just kind of trended up being home um, and guessing at seven weeks out now back to Texas, back in the um, swing of things in my routine and sticking to very strict like weighed out meals instead of just having the random odds and ends items and like fruit along the day and just kind of snacking um, we'll kind of expect to see weight come down but still in a very healthy spot with seven weeks out um, and you guys will kind of see the posing footage on screen as well not a lot has changed with the physique um, and then just a fair warning for you guys, I am missing one of the weigh-ins, and that was the day traveling up, driving up, so didn't have a weigh-in in the morning. And then we'll have a similar thing for seven weeks out, just missing one day when we were driving through. Um, but not anything else really to cover there. Nutrition-wise, we'll come back to the roughly 2850 to 2900 calories that we've been running for a week or two. Um, if we're still seeing weight either trending up or remaining flat, may have to do a calorie cut. But at this point in prep, we're kind of on the home stretch for the first show. So kind of um, what would be expected for me. But yeah, very happy with the physique. Starting to see lines come in that I've never seen before. So definitely on pace to absolutely blow away the physique we had in 2019 as a teen when I competed um, first. So just, yeah, super excited. Got to stay on pace and stay on track with everything, but in a very good headspace and have good energy levels now was definitely a much needed week, kind of pulling back on the diet training. Um, but hopefully you guys did go on to enjoy the video. Thank you so much for watching the end. Really appreciate you guys tuning into the prep content. As always, if you have any questions, comments, concerns, leave those down below. And as always, have a great rest of your day and stay fed.